Good morning, fellow mathematicians. Welcome back to another video. Today we are going to destroy an identity that is pretty uh, tedious to prove in the normal case if you do it using integral stuff. So um, here goes, we are using something that we have used extensively before in our little analytic number theory introduction course that we are doing here on this channel. We are going to take a look at the infinite product expansion for our sine. Okay, so if we take a look at the sine of x, well, what is that? It's just basically the linear combination of our zeros, okay? And this notation just means that k runs from 1 to infinity, okay? That's all that it really means. So we are going to have 1 minus, okay, x squared over pi squared k squared. And what we basically want to do, we want to plug in pi over 2 as our x value because, well, the sine of pi over 2 is nothing but 1. If we take a look at the graph, for example, or you can show it using Euler's formula or whatsoever. So we are going to plug in x being equal to pi over 2. Well, sine of pi over 2, like I said, is nothing but 1. This results in nothing but um, pi over 2 times. Okay, we are going to have this infinity grill. 1 minus, okay, x squared is nothing but um, pi squared over 2 squared, you could say. So this is going to give us pi squared over 2 squared, pi squared, k squared. Okay, cool thing is, this irrational boy cancels out. Now, we are going to have, okay, this chunk right here, I'm going to write it out once again. This is going to give us, um, yeah, exactly. Um, if we write this out, we are going to get 1 minus 1 over 2 squared k squared, okay? I'm go just going to put it like this, 2 times k squared, for reasons that will become apparent in a minute. We can expand this fraction, this one, by 2k squared over 2k squared, leaving us with, okay, 2k squared minus 1 over 2k squared. 1 is nothing but 1 squared, meaning this up here is nothing but the difference of two squares. That's why I put it like this, okay? Leaving us with, we can, for example, multiply both sides by 2 over pi. It's not equal to 0 because pi is nothing but e, it's nothing but 2. So 2 over 2 is 1. That's the success of 0. So not equal to 0. So that's coolio, meaning 2 over pi, or just 1, okay? <laughs> However you prefer it, for small values of pi, this actually holds. <laughs> we are going to get this infinite product of, okay, difference of two squares gives us 2k minus 1 times 2k plus 1 over 2k squared. Now, k runs from 1 in this case. Okay, meaning up here the least value we, we can get is 1 times 3, so that's not equal to 0. And for all other values of k, it's not going to be equal to 0 up here. Also, this is something positive squared is positive, strictly greater than 0, meaning all elements in this infinite sum are actually greater than zero, meaning they are invertible. We can take the reciprocal on both, square, uh, on, on both sides to actually get that pi over two is nothing but, okay, one over this infinite product is just the infinite product it, itself of those arguments, but the reciprocal of that. Leaving us with exactly that if we split up our product. And this is it. So there's nothing more I can say about this. It's pretty easy provable using this way. Um, <laughs> it's pretty damn beautiful to do it like this. Um, yeah, you, you can do it by constructing yourself a sequence of integrals. That's the standard method you find in most textbooks, I guess. That's how Wally actually did it the first time he did it. Uh, yeah, but you know, the first time is always a bit messy, so it figures that it was a hard thing for him to do. And yeah, um, this thing is kind of important with it. You can prove a part of Stirling's formula. We are going to prove Stirling's formula in a different way, not by making use of Valley's product. I just wanted to make a video on it because why the hell not? We derived this expansion right here pretty hard. So 
we might as well make use of it. I thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please like and subscribe and recommend channel if you like. If you want to support channel with more by those teachers I created, or support channel on Patreon, blah blah. blah. Up until next video, have a fl flammable product day. See ya.